The other day, we played a clip of a Owen Schroyer, who refers to himself as the cuck slayer, who went to a rally in uh, Austin, Texas, I believe it was, and was interviewing people. And um, he, after talking to uh, one guy, he turned to talk to a girl who, uh, based upon mm, my guess, would be closer to 11 or 12 years old. Um, 13. That's around the age of my daughter. And uh, here's how the beginning of that conversation went. How are you, young man? Um, you're an idiot. Okay, wow, wait a second. Who taught you that language? Oh, I'm sorry. Can we go? Can we dial that back? What did he say? What was his salutation? How are you? How are you, young man? Um, you're and she says, you're an effing idiot. And he goes on to take offense. In fact, um, he made it back into the studio. The cuck slayer did. Um, and uh, now he's, uh, he's wearing his, his jacket and tie and his little lapel pin, uh, as most cuck slayers do. And uh, here is his recap with Alex Jones. Let's play a clip of this young lady last weekend in Austin. How are you, young man? Um, you're an idiot. Wow, who taught you that language? Come on, come on, My mother. Come on, come on, come on. So your mother taught you that foul language? In the car. And why am I an idiot? Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. And then flicks off the camera. Looks like about a 9, 10-year-old girl. Yeah, and I, and I said... Me. She already, you know, acts basically like a... Yeah, just like some thug woman, like, yeah, I got Inca tattoos on my arms, yeah. You know, I got, hey, you do it, I'm running them, you know. It's kind of like the Trump thing, how they said, like, he was doing this and mimicking uh, somebody that had mental disabilities. They say I said man. I always say ma'am and sir when I do these. Well, that, 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 that they lie. All They're right, pause all... it for one second. So, in other words, the cuck slayer would have us believe that he said, how are you, young ma'am? <laughs> That's what I, how I address young women, too. Hey, young ma'am. Hello, young ma'am. Young madam. And does he say, how are you, young sir? I am the cuck slayer. Young ma'am, young sir, I am the cuck slayer. I have traveled far and wide to meet you, young sir. Continue. Fiction writers in liberal media, and so they have to make it your bad, so you say ma'am... And clearly you say ma'am on the tape, but that's what they do. Well, but notice who they're talking about, Owen. Let's, who are they talking about, Owen? All right, pause. Alex. It. Now, look, this is, this is the most interesting part to me. He says, notice who they're talking about, Owen. He's, he's sort of smiling and laughing. Notice who they're talking about, Owen. And Owen starts to chuckle. And this is what gives away their game, right? Because Alex Jones has been saying to Owen for the years that Owen's been working for him. The key to this is to do something that creates controversy so they talk about you. That's the only thing that's important in our business. That's why I freaked out when Donald Trump won because I didn't think I would be able to make as much money. And we are in wrestling. We're pro wrestlers. And it's super important. You want to be the guy. You want to be the guy they... they, they that at least part of the audience comes to see you because they hate you. So, Owen, I was right. I was right. You know it. That's why you're chuckling. We're both chuckling. So dial it back and watch this again. Clearly you say ma'am on the tape. But that's what they do. Well, but notice who they're talking about, Owen. Let's, who are they talking about, Owen? <laughs> Alex, let's, uh, if you don't mind, I, I'd actually like to read some scripture here that I found comfort in last night because I, I'm serious. I, I, this was tough for me, Alex. I've never been character assassinated like this from hundreds of people at once. It was, it was, it was, it was eye-opening to me. You're telling them, help me, I'm weak. So here's the Jedi scripture. are taking over. Here, here's some scripture that I found comforting. <laughs> that it, Sorry. The end of all things is near. This is from Peter, by the way. The end of all things is near. Therefore, be alert and sober of mind so that you may pray. Above all, love each other deeply because love covers a multitude of sins. Offer hospitality to one another without grumbling. We're seeing that right now. 
Each of you should use whatever gift you have received to serve others as faithful stewards of God's grace in various forms. Dear friends, do not be surprised at the fiery ordeal that has come on to test you oh, as though something strange were happening <laughs> no to you. No pun rejoice in as much as you participate in the suffering of Christ so that you may be overjoyed when his glory is revealed. But there were also false prophets among the people, just as there will be false teachers among you. <laughs> is he admitting that They will that, secretly uh, introduce Alex destructive heresies, fraud? even denying the sovereign Lord who brought them, bringing swift destruction of themselves. Many will follow their depraved conduct and will bring the way of truth in disrepute. And that's what's happening is, the, the story isn't some kids flipping you off. All of them cuss, all of them scream, all of them are hateful, none of them can talk, and they celebrate small children acting like, you know, they're like some woman that's running a meth lab or something. I mean, I'm not saying a little girl does that, but I mean, she's like, eh, come on. Because I can't, I can't afford to get fired. I can't, can't afford to get sued soul, again by Mitch Obani the back, the back door. door. Oh, and incidentally, today, the, the reading of the scripture that had absolutely nothing to do with what we were talking about, gold, pure gold. What did I tell you, right? Did I tell you this? When you came back with that tape, did I not say, this is going to be great, and I want you to pretend like you said, young ma'am, okay? Because we've got it. We've got everything we need here. we got the young kid. What did I tell you? Pets and young kids. If you can get them in a video flipping you off. And on top of that, an opening to read scripture. Okay. And also the aggrievement. The aggrievement from a woman. There's, she's a girl, but you could still say you're aggrieved by others. We've hit the trifecta. You're going to believe me. Wait till, you, wait till you see what happens to your Twitter account. Owen's much better at that than Mike Cernovich is, for instance. That's the other thing. And part of why I wanted to play that is I feel bad for Cernovich because when you see Owen there, who's a natural, right? I mean, Owen's a real natural. He knows he's going to whip out the—I uh, the, um, I wish he, he had memorized, frankly, the Scripture. That would have been better, but— That's Glenn Beck level. That's—yeah, but— Cernovich has got to watch something like that and just turn to his wife and just be like, oh, oh, what can I do? Sweetheart, you can't just keep making these periscopes that are going nowhere. You've just got to practice. Just practice. Let's you and I, pra let's run it again. <laughs> I think that's happening in the Cernovich home. She was talking about coaching him. Do you think it's possible that, like, right now, She's like, Mike, I have printed out. I have printed. And now, of course, she speaks much quicker than I do. That might be a regional thing, or I don't know what. But uh, she speaks with a lot more urgency and uh, quickness than I do. Whatever they're doing, I'm sure it's urgent. Right. And they could be acting out. Like, she could have written out the transcript of that piece, and they could act it out again. And this is how you would do it differently, Mike. So when, let the video play. <laughs> let the video play. Let's practice this. You not hearing an ounce of silence and then jumping in. Can we practice that? Hi, folks. Sam Cedar here. We still need your help on our Patreon page. YouTube ads have come back, but not nearly as much as we had before. So if you can help us out, any little bit helps. Head over to our Patreon page right at this URL and you'll help us keep helping you by making videos.